Right, what is going on guys? My name is Jason Brown and this is yet another boring video about the Animal Fig Adapter. Well, I hope not, but we'll try our best. Now shout out to my friend Jack who lent me his 50mm 1.8D Nikon lens because I was wondering if it would work with the Animal Fig Adapter in front of it. Now this is the lens that I usually use, or the one I've been using for the past two weeks, it is a Pentacon f1.8 50mm lens, but it's an M42 screw. So with the adapter it becomes a 55mm lens. That means I can't use this to see if a native 50 will work properly. So on the camera right now is the native 50mm 1.8D, so the last generation one. And it's at f4 and 100 ISO, we've got light so it's bright enough. And I want you to check the corners and hopefully there'll be things in frame like lights and that because I can't really bother to clear it out properly but hopefully there'll be no vignetting or sort of dark spots in the corner. This is because I've managed to actually wrap the anamorphic lens um, around the front of the 50mm lens. It sort of like backs in and just sort of covers it up like that, which is really, really cool. And when I saw that, I thought, hang on, I don't need the step-up ring on this 50mm 1.8. I can take it off and perhaps do the same thing and yield better results, but that's not what I'm trying to aim for. I'm trying to find the perfect widest lens to use with this adapter. Now I've got my laptop here and I've got a cup of tea here and I'm going to cycle through some clips and just talk to you about the nitty gritty of what I um, experienced in Orkney in terms of using the camera. Okay, so in this clip you can see I take my phone out and I show you how little flare I think this lens produces, which is um, interesting in terms of how clean it is. However, it did mess with my audio, obviously. Um, why wouldn't it? So the whole audio is lost at this point. And then in this clip I talk about this um, video that I took on the beach in one of the most beautiful beaches in Orkney, with my family walking down there. And you can see if I zoom in here, we check the corners, we check the center. Um, it's really just a very, very well-defined lens and I couldn't see any color shift, I couldn't see um, any added vignetting unless I had the wrong lens on. So um, thank you so much for watching. Again, the audio is lost here, but I'm Jason for the Extreme Sounds Audio Division YouTube channel. See ya.